Research shows climate change is having a major impact on our health. In today's Medical Minute, Michael George explains how rising temperatures make conditions like allergies and asthma even worse. When wildfires fill the California sky with smoke, Brandon De La Paz feels the pain. Do you remember going out and just kind of breathing in the air and it just hurt a little bit more than usual? De La Paz has asthma and could be facing many more days of discomfort. A Princeton study finds in parts of Northern California, the warming climate could cause particle pollution from wildfires to increase more than 50% by the middle of the century. Those tiny particles have been linked to cardiovascular disease and bronchitis. And for asthma patients, the effects can be life-threatening. It feels like you're breathing out of a straw. Um, and so as you can imagine, that can be quite uncomfortable, quite uh, scary. People don't realize that we see deaths every day from asthma. Thousands of miles from wildfire country, climate change is messing with Mother Nature in other ways that affect our health. As temperatures rise, so do pollen counts. That's because a warmer earth means longer growing seasons, giving plants more time to shed the pollen that causes allergies. At the current rate of global warming, by the end of the century, spring pollen season is projected to start about 40 days earlier and last up to 19 days longer than it does now. Dr. Purvi Parikh recommends allergy shots for desensitizing her patients. And what that does is that um, it eventually makes them stop reacting. So many of those individuals actually have had a very easy pollen season compared to those who aren't on it because their immune systems are not as reactive anymore. The CDC says as many as 60 million Americans suffer from seasonal allergies each year, a headache that will likely get worse. Michael George, CBS News, New York.